subscribe and do some work. And have some fun with our videos we have. Hey there everyone. It is Sunday afternoon. We don't really like to plan on Sundays. We don't like to work on Sundays. Sundays is our day of rest. Day to recoup, spend time with family. But it rained a little bit this morning, and we're going to go out. Liam and Sawyer and I are going to plant a few beans. I do believe these boys are more excited to come ride in the tractor than they are for Christmas morning. When the boys come to ride with me in the tractor, their favorite thing to do is not just ride, but to eat. Um, How are you doing, Sawyer? He's eating carrots. He's eating carrots. Eating carrots, I'm eating a peanut butter jelly sandwich. deep it's planting make sure we're at the right depth we got to make sure we're in moisture it's been really really dry here and if we're not planting into moisture corn won't germinate so we're gonna dig see what we find make sure everything looks good so we're just a little over two inches deep which is right where we want to be two inches there's good moisture it's still a little bit cool down there that's okay we're about 80 degrees today it's going to warm up the best time of the day Lunch time. I have a small problem. I have run out of seed in the planter. Hey Greta. Hey you. Yes. Yes. Oh. It's almost middle of the day. I'm just getting started. So I have to go and work in some washouts now down at one of our farms. And we're running short on tractors, actually. And instead of being underpowered and putting the 4440 on, I'm going to completely overpower the disc and put the quad track on. And uh, we affectionately call it the whale. Why am I using this exceptionally overpowered tractor to pull a disc, you ask? Because we don't have another one available. Ugly, the paint was bad when we got it, the air conditioning kind of comes and goes, the hydraulics work sometimes, lights are sketchy, the turn signal to the right doesn't work quite right. And when you're going down the road, this thing just bounces you to death. Oh, good morning. Another day is upon us, and we have a lot to do today, and not a lot of time to do it. Things like maybe fix a planter, maybe we'll plant some beans today, maybe we'll plant some corn today. Maybe I just can't make anything work right, so we're just not going to do anything today. Either way, you can hang out, come along, see what we do or don't do. Someone's here. Don't know who's here. 
What's that? Oh, that's not my camera. That thing is huge. Should they smell each other? Yeah, they could. <laughs> DOT approved. Did you see that, guys? Cole the Corn Star just parked his truck in my yard. Let's have some fun. All right, what moving violation? We don't have what parking violation. He invented a space, double parking, blocking access, general selfish behavior. Let's go put it on his truck. We'll just slip this right in here and we'll let him deal with his ticket that he got. We are up in the top of the seed tender, putting some seed lubricant on these beans. So when these beans go through the planter, you have to have lubricant on them to make sure as they go through, they're not abrasive then. So we put this on. One thing you're gonna notice is soybeans are supposed to be what color? Everyone say it together. Blue, no, not blue. Soybeans are supposed to be purple. No, not purple. Beans are normally yellow. And why are these beans red? Because these beans have fungicide and insecticide on them, which when they're underground, keeps bugs from eating them. They also have an inoculant. Helps them grow better, essentially. Made it down to the seed tender. Noah's just about around. We're gonna get this thing unfolded so that we are ready for him when he gets here. We can fill him with seed, fill him with fuel, and then go do the same thing for dad. Well, change of plan. Sawyer and I are gonna plant corn. You kinda of took a tumble. We're driving here. Noah's driving over there. Should we see if he wants to race? I'm, I'm kinda of creeping right now. I can't see any of these rocks on the corn stalks. Rocks are unimportant. Just the faster you go, the further down you'll push them. That's Noah going backwards. Wrong direction, Noah. Forward, boy. Forward. I'm going to win now. I'm going to win. The whole family minus Sawyer came to visit. This is great. You going to drive, Ellie? Oh, hey there! Come on, I didn't even see you standing there. Here I am just checking off things that need to be done today, like plant some more corn and beans. I am gonna load up a few bags, head over to the field. I quit at like 11 o'clock last night because I'm just tired. And so, throw a few bags in the back of my pickup and then we're gonna go over and see if we can get some corn planted this morning. If all this goes well, I'm gonna have time to be able to quit for a little while tonight. Taylor and I wanna go to a marriage conference we have not been to something like that for a long time and that is my number one priority is taking good care of her and taking care of my family and I need to do those sorts of things. So I'm gonna go at it real hard, try to get enough done to where we can do that. If all goes really well, we should be done with corn by tomorrow. Time to go plant some corn! Got to check the oil first. <laughs> Trick for all you farmers. I know you all want to eat out of your lunch pail, but the problem is you're always bending over, trying to get stuff off the floor. I submit to you the lunch pail holder. You got a buddy seat, you just pull this around, strap this guy in. Now your lunch pail is all safe. He's not gonna fall off. When you go bouncing through a washout because you're watching a cat video, instead of watching your plant or the tractor, your lunch pail won't go falling off. Well, this isn't good. This farm usually has a ton of fox holes on it, coyote holes, whatever they are, and uh, I found one. That's not supposed to be like that. Guess who's riding today? Elbow came to ride. Need some water. 
When it's spring and fall time, we have daddy-daughter dates in the tractor and the combine, don't we? Yeah. I'm still really new to this, guys. Thank you so much for tuning in, for watching, for putting up with things like me forgetting to actually film the ending of certain things. Like, hey, we hooked up the disc, but mm, Caleb forgot to take the camera and actually film the disc disking anything. So, I just really appreciate you guys. Good. <laughs> <laughs> I just really appreciate you guys sticking with me. We've got like a thousand acres to go, some beans to finish up, and then we're gonna get done planting early this year. Hang with us, check back for the next one. We'll finish up then. Family Farm, out. <laughs>